that uh, Steve Corica will be looking for is a faster start from Sydney FC. They were way too slow out of the blocks against MacArthur during the week. Another a chance here. Bahaja's pace has got him there ahead of Merchela. In towards Adam Lafondra! What a start for Sydney FC! And that is a splendid finish from the Englishman as a 10-game scoring drought comes to an end. What a finish. The Harvey Norman replay, we asked for a quick start from Sydney and more clinical finishing as well. And Adam LaFonda has provided there. Fantastic start for Sydney FC. So it's going to be the in-swinger from Troisi. Away by Talbot or oh, Nikonic put it into a zone where Tom Ahmed could fall into the back of the net. That is a stunning goal, and the Wanderers are all square. And it's a mistake by Milos Nikonic that has presented the Israeli international with that opportunity. Well, we saw the stat earlier about the goals from set pieces. It was a nice ball in that Sydney couldn't get away. It's a poor clearance. The Harvey Norman replay shows. And as they go up for the second ball, it's Tom Ahmed who reacts quickly and volleys it straight across the face of Pavlicic. And that is a fantastic finish. I thought, he's just going to volley this. Just pressure early, early in the game. That's a lovely touch by Lafondra. Barbarous is in behind. The cutback will find Callum Tolbert. Good save, Margus. Here you see... This here is a great touch from Talbot. And he look, he gets up, has a look and picks his spot. Margush is up to the task. Watchable opening 30 minutes. Chested down by Ogawa. Oh, he's got numbers here. It's Petratos, Traore outside him. Petratos went himself. Traore is angry that he didn't play him in. But I think he was probably entitled to shoot there. As you see here, as it comes to Petrados, Traor is just going around the outside. Corner taken short. Asbeck inviting Talbot to have a crack here. It's not a bad try. And Daniel Margosh fingertips it over the bar. Great action. He's so far out, I don't think anyone expected him to strike it. Wow, didn't he get a hold of it? Turn from Petratos. Barbarusis not shirking his defensive responsibility. Jasper caught in possession. Troisi had to take it first time. He couldn't hit the target, but Mark Radan likes that aggressive pressing. It was a good press. Jasper who tried the little cheeky flick. Nikovic. Jasbek. Come to the defensive line there for Milos Nikovic. Sadiq. Looks promising. I break for Bahaja! 2 1 Sydney FC. Trent Bahaja strikes. 20 minutes into the second half. And for the second time in the game, Steve Corica's team lead. Well, particularly in this second half, it's been Trent Bahaja breaking down that right-hand side and looking to get balls into the box. And it's Barbarousas who squares it up, and as the ball falls on the Harvey Norman replay, Bahaja's first to react and slots it away. Sydney got numbers behind the ball, and Rattray will carry it forward. And what a ball from Rattray, and Bahaja's away. Kankar's after him. Still Trent Bahaja could finish it here. It's two! for Trent Bahaja, and perhaps the derby is won for Sydney FC. Cracking finish, big smile on the face of Steve Corica. And it looks as though Sydney will be sky blue tonight. What a ball it was. Harvey Norman replay shows Trent Bahaja streaking away, cuts back inside, composure to look up, picks his spot with the left foot, and fires at home. 3-1 Sydney. Okay, more of an arm wrestle in that midfield area. Limited chances in the second half, and then Sydney have just flicked the switch. Down the 
Traore is the other player who's come off for the Wanderers. So uh, Fulina has switched over to the left. Here's a chance for them. Tate Russell, it's crept in. Game on. You can see the run on the Harvey Norman replay. Wonderful ball, and he just uses the flight of the ball and loops it over the keeper into that far corner. Pavlosic is stretching, but he can't get there, and it's game on. Well, it was almost in slow motion, wasn't it? As Pavlosic turned and head after it. And he just could not reach it. 